Okay, let's do a box break of the old Flea 1991 basketball player photo cards. The one on the NBA hoops before, but I believe that these ones are a lot cooler for some reason. Look how old the boxes are. I don't even know if these came shrink wrapped. I know the other set did of Flea. I think the set after this one came. What do you call it? factory sealed. I'm never sure if this one actually ever did because I've never seen a box that still retains its factory seal. So there are all the cards. Let's start ripping through these. See what we can come up with. Oh, oh goodness. I remember ripping into some of these back in the old days. I'll just take them out of the packet. We've got a Larry Nance. Hopefully the light's okay. I've got the light on and the window open. But here we go. You got all the stats on the back and stuff, which I thought was pretty cool. I like these cards. I like. I don't know. There's just something about the design of these flare cards that were pretty cool. Dominic Wilkins. Let's see if I can get them in the screen properly. Yeah, I remember having this card. I think I had this card as well. I came the large one and this one. But yeah, these are good old cards. These ones, I tell you what, I'll tell you what, right now. Sitting around for years waiting to be opened. And here's their chance. Jerome Kersey, good grief. My goodness, look at that mullet. Out of control. John Carr, John Paxson, Charles Oakley, John Stockton. Pretty sure I had that cut. Oh, awesome. Irvin Johnson. This would be a cool card to have. Look at that. Look at that beauty. Number 100. 25 points per 48 minutes, 25.2 rebounds and assists. Nice. I might actually just separate that card and just put that over there. Rod Strickland, Spurs, Jerome Kersey. Look at that. I'll have to count through these later, see if you can. If it's possible to get look at that only four ninety nine. Four ninety nine is a packet? Are you serious? That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. Yes, yeah, so I was wondering maybe you'd be able to get a set here. What's this all star game thing? Well you can rate that if you want to, but there you go, there's the all star game wrap up I guess summary yeah it'd be interesting to see if you could get a full set out of this there's Dennis Rodman pretty cool I might probably be able to get an autograph card of Dennis Rodman soon put that aside one of my you know kind of cool favorite players here's the all-star game again a summary. Let's switch moon. Wait more cards. Open this up. Yeah, these are a lot different. Oh, look at that. Patrick Ewing art card. That's pretty nice, eh? Pretty nice indeed. And then everything else is upside down, so that must be your insert card from back in the day. I know in the NBA hoops you could open a whole box and not 
Okay, there's Phil Jackson, a set. I remember one dude got one card off an entire set from opening a box. Wouldn't that be entirely infuriating or frustrating? So you'd have to hunt down that extra card. Oh yeah, look at that. Michael Jordan card, that's nice, League Leaders. There you go. Phil Bailey. Nine nine one All Star game. Another one and another. Just me and the boys. You can read that if you want to. Should be able to read it. James Worthy. Dip lifts room. Kevin Willis. That's a pretty nice card, though. That's a pretty nice shot, anyway. Tim Hardaway. Oh boy, this is going to be a long video, huh? <laughs> Six minutes in, and we haven't even gone through one quarter of the cards yet. Bernard King. J.R. Reid, I had used to have his rookie card. No, that's a nice one, too. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I wonder if these are actually, they probably are. Have a little bit, a bit of a higher value than the normal cards. North Star game again. Another summary. Sean Kim, John Stockton again, traded to Sacramento, Spud Webb, Whew. Will Perdue, Will Perdue, Isaiah Thomas, Hornets, Clyde Drexler. There are his stats. Terry Cummings. Now there's old Bill Carr, right? Pretty cool picture. What's you see on the back of this one? So I guess that's why I liked it because they had you know, a couple of action shots on the card. And a profile pick. So they were a lot cooler than your average trading cards. Fourteen cards a pack's not too bad either. Michael Jordan, very nice, awesome card, I love it, I love that card. And we gain the pile, as along with Patrick Ewing, another awesome card. Another awesome player who I loved from the 90s. So that was an awesome pack, if you had that pack you'd be pretty happy with yourself. Let's see who else is in this craziness. Sam Perkins. Slam Dunk D. Brown. 
Here's BJ Armstrong, Sean Kemp again. But a different car. So we haven't actually seen, as far as I can tell, any double ups so far. So that's pretty awesome. Eh? We've got through a quarter of the cards with no double ups. As far as I can remember. We've got two variations of cards for some players. So as we saw Sean Kemp and Michael Jordan, there's a variation on the base set, whatever. Oh, I remember seeing Chuck Daly. So this could be a fully and complete double up set of cards, which it looks pretty much like it. So potentially, I wonder if you can make multiple sets in this. I wonder how many cards. I should have really looked at that first. What's this? Order your favorite flare NBA 3D plastic basketball card. Turn your favorite flare NBA card into a unique 3D display piece. A player jumps out of the background, and every card makes a great display. It comes with its own stand. Hmm. Okay, that sounds pretty awesome. So once again, is this going to be a full kind of double up set? Hmm. Quite possibly. Quite possibly. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Not sure if I've seen this Jordan one before. So I think these are pretty much unique cards from here on. Oh yeah, I haven't seen Robert Parrish. And I have definitely not seen Scotty Pippen. So there you go couple of double up packs and back in the day it appeared to be oh there's Charles Barkley well we definitely haven't seen that and Gary Payton so they turn the card upside down before they get to the hit and this one's off center but yeah back in the day it was common to get double up full packs that were completely doubled up. I'm not sure if they do that these days. I mean, you might get one or two you know, cards that are the same in one pack to another pack, but I don't think the entire pack is the same. But I remember back in the day opening a pack and you know exactly what would be in it. As soon as you saw the first card. Horace Green. Chris Mullen. Carl Malone, good card that one. Dominic Wilkins, again I think, but a variation card. Awesome. Very awesome. Oops. Take a while to sort these cards out though. Into a set if possible. Brian, oh there you go, David Robinson. Awesome. One of my favorite players. Unfortunately, I didn't get to grow up to be as tall as Robinson or Ewing. Hoping I might have been, but you know, came up a foot short. This is going to be a Chris Mellon variant card. But Williams. There's a period of blah, 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 blah. Patrick Ewing. 
Oster card. Interesting. Oh, there's Rick Helman. And there's the Chris Mullen. Um, variant forward, forward card. So, so far we've got two packs that were exa exactly identical. Which was starting to worry me there for a minute, but all these other packs completely unique. Same with this one. Get them Kale. Heart card, Carl Malone, Heart card, and this would be a very awesome pack because then you've got Jordan All Star Team card. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Very, very nice indeed. And I think you've even got All Star Game. Some kind of summary of that. Da 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 da. -da. And then at the very end, oh no, you've even got Reggie Miller in this and Charles Barkley. So you'd be pretty happy with that pack. You'd be pretty much over the moon with that pack. That is an awesome pack to have got to have scored. Let me tell you. Let me tell you that story. Sherman Douglas. Vladi Divac. There's your checklist, which might be important. Um, oh gosh. It's probably cut out a whole lot of light now, which is pretty crappy. To be honest with you, let's see if we can get some light going on here. Well, that's probably a bit better. Should have done that at the beginning. And there we go, there's 120 cards. I'm going to keep that checklist separate because I want to check if we got a set. Later on, Jeff Malone, something else. Da da dee dee da da da. Dale Ellis, James Edward, D. Brown, Kevin Johnson, Sherman Douglas. Cracking into the second half of the set. We have got David Robinson straight up first. Really nice card. Let's see if I can get a bit more light in here. That's good. And there you go, there's a good picture on the back. Probably about too much light after I angle the cards now. Awesome. Absolutely fantastic. Now we've got cards upside down. Why is that? I'm not certain why. It usually indicates something, but nothing's indicated here so far. Larry Bird, even. Should we check out him's stats on the back? There you go, there's Larry Bird. Bugsy Moogs. Pretty cool. I must admit that's pretty cool. Here we go. Who we got here? Cliff Livingston. Carl Malone. AC Green. Another David Robinson. Checklist. Another David Robinson. Man, if you're a David Robinson fan, this would be the most perfect pack. Get all the David Robinson cards at once. That's pretty awesome. Charles Barkley again. Xavier McDaniels. Maybe having his cut. 
Whoa, look at that. What is this? A cut. Piece of a cut card thing. Magic. Weird. I wonder if that counted for a card. I wonder if it counted for a card. One, two, three, four, five, six. 10, 11, 12, 13. I think it did count for a card. Oh, that would really, that would really get you, wouldn't it? Monster card, eh? Reggie Miller again. Charles Barkley again. Patrick Ewing again. Wonderful. If there's 120 cards, that must be possible to make one, if not two, sets out of a box. Oops, upside down here. I'm going to say Thomas again, again, again. Whoa, and there it is. There's the Jordan card. Look at that, two of six. Awesome. So I guess opening a whole box you get the whole lot. And there's another Jordan. Double up Jordan. Uh, hold on price. So I'll put the Jordan in a separate pile to the other piles. It'd be nice to make two sets. There's Will Purdue again. There's Horace Grant again. Yep, there's Buzz Longer. There's Will Purdue. So it looks like you can get doubles of everything except probably the art cards. Upside down, all star game. Rob Parrish again. Scotty Pippen again. And we've got another card. Charles Barkley again. A little bit better centered. A bit better centered. Put that in a separate pile. And then we've got Gary Payton in the end. Yeah, pretty cool. Don't think you'll be able to get all these cards in this box. But apparently you can. So pretty much Sean Elliott pretty much scored all the hits that I wanted to find in here. All the Jordan cards completed. Almost there, we're into the last quarter soon. We're only 23 minutes into this video. There's another Dave Robinson, so we've got three. On that card. Now we're just skimming through because we've seen most of them. Last quarter. This should be a lot quicker. Here's a checklist. Charles Barkley, Xavier McDaniels, Cliff Livingston, AC Green or somebody. Here we go. Oh, good grief. Out of control. Go. Sean Elliott again. Morris Grant again. Scotty Pippen again. Sean Malone again. Carl Malone again. 
Robert Parrish again, Scotty Pippen again. Now the only thing we're looking for is one more Michael Jordan card and a art card maybe. I don't think we've got all of them. Oh, and a Magic Johnson card too. We ain't got more than one of those, have we? I don't believe. Mullet, Paxton, Stockton, there it is. So maybe there are two sets here without two sets of the heart cards. You only get one set, maybe. Oh my goodness, look at this. Another completely identical pack. Three packs to go, ladies and gentlemen. And then we can be on our way to potentially opening some other kind of pack. And another video, of course. A king of the large one. Da -da 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 piece of a card that fell out. It's amazing. Hopefully that didn't count for a card. It'll squeal like that. Here we go. James Edwards. Oh we got an upside down card. Patrick Ewing, Michael Jordan, there he is. So I believe there may be two sets in a box. And then we've got upside down cards for some reason. Why have we got three upside down cards for? It's weird. Last pack. Pat Riley. Dennis Rodman. So that's the other card we needed. We throw it up on. There we are. That's it. That's the whole lot. And that's what it looks like. Big stack of cards everywhere. I'm not sure if we actually got the full art card set. We may have missed out one of the set, one or two of the set. I actually have a check through. There's two. There's three. There's four, there's five. Oh, how about that? That would get you pretty much nastily. Because here's the sixth one, which of course is a double up. So I don't know who the cards would have been. Three of six, so we're missing one of the art cards. So we've got two of six, five of six, three of six, six of six, Four of six. So we're missing one of six. Who wonder who that number one was? Anyway, that's not that's not heartbreaking at all. It's not a huge disappointment. So there we are. That, that is the nineteen ninety one Flair Basketball Player Fitter Cards, new Provision Sport Art Cards, randomly packed. See back for details, fourteen cards in a pack. Thank you for you know getting to this point of the video if you got this far and we'll have more break videos later i am actually looking at getting some trucking cards so i'm going to break a couple of series of truck cards have a look at some more gpk cards and so on and so on see you next time <laughs>